Today, we are taking a look at a masterpiece nestled inside of Saltfish Point. This private sea island community epitomizes opulence. Imagine a sprawling estate boasting nearly 12,000 square feet of sheer elegance. Six bedrooms, six bathrooms, designed by the renowned Kelly and Kelly architects, interiors curated by the illustrious Gloria Black designs, from its state-of-the-art amenities to breathtaking views of the St. Lucia River, this property is a testament to architectural brilliance and exquisite taste. Dive into a world where Italian marble meets European oak flooring, where private patios offer serene river views, and where the aqua blue waters of Hutchinson Island promise to take your breath away. So, buckle up as we embark on a journey through this luxurious haven. Here we are. As soon as I walked in, I'm just enjoying incredible open water views. Even the design of this home, as soon as I stepped inside, it already took my breath away. Look above the ceiling. You have this graphic design going from one end to the other. You have dental crown molding. And as you step down into this lowered living room, wow. The staging in here, absolutely impeccable. You have a fireplace on one side for those warm Christmas mornings and open these doors up and you've got the ocean calling your name. Amazing. And while we're in here, let's just look up real quick. Look at this. We've got rope lighting. Is that, is that what it's called? Who knows? And then behind the rope lighting, you have these beams. This is a home that has character, you know, I feel like I know the owner very well just from being in here for five seconds. And so we'll make our way heading towards the kitchen and dining room. And on the way to the dining room, we actually have a full guest bathroom over here. The white oak floors lead in. You have stone floors leading up to the walls. It's on the sink. Just a great place for your guests to freshen up. And here it is. This is where every Thanksgiving, every Christmas, every holiday that requires a place to sit and dine together, this is where you're doing it. And look at the space how wide the walls are from each other. You feel like you have endless room to laugh and eat. Look at the accent lighting. And then once again, Gloria killed it. Look at the light fixtures. I mean, this is just a place where you want to dine. You want to entertain. And then you have this window over here. And of course, since we're in Florida, hurricane impact windows. So they can be doing landscaping outside. Whatever is going on outside does not affect you and your party. You're in peace and tranquility. That was beautiful. And so as we make our way a little bit further down, it takes us towards our kitchen. I mean, where do I even start? Decor, appliances, you have this huge fridge and I was told the fridge was staged for the YouTube video. Boom. You got your ice perfectly formed. You got your Pellegrinos, not one has been touched. That's a charcuterie kit. Oh my God, I'm in love. That's how every house should be, especially when you're in this price point. These agents care about this house. And you can see this gorgeous backsplash, the gorgeous finish on the countertops. It even waterfalls down from the island. Barstool seating. You've got this gorgeous sink with a sliding hide the dirty dishes tray. That's what I like to call it. The drying rack. You even have, what is this, Eric? A salad bowl going on over here? Who knows? These rich people, they have everything. We're learning slowly. You and me together, YouTube. And then of course, this is where your water stream will come. Your fresh water cleans your soul. It's so good. And I skipped a few things down below because you know, there's just so much to talk about. I don't wanna get held up, but of course you got dual dishwashers. You have a drink cooler slides out. So if you're entertaining, this is what you're gonna need. And how can I forget it? Your Italian gas stove with the vent above. And of course, everybody's favorite, the water spout. So you just fill up each dish. You don't have to worry about carrying a, I mean, who wants to carry water from here to here? No, it just fills up right, right there, making life easy for you. As we come further down, this is a very chill breakfast area. And once again, just like the dining room, you got these windows, hurricane impact, of course, but this time water views, pool views, sky views. This is where you enjoy a morning with the family. These are perfect Aperol spritz glasses. Imagine having a spritzy here with you and the pals. I'm sorry, I had to go off script for a second because I wouldn't mind one. And then the best part is from here, to have a coffee, you don't have to even go all the way back into the kitchen. Right here, Mila, coffee maker. And guess what? 
more drink coolers down below. Basically what I'm getting from this house is that your guests are gonna be completely hydrated no matter where they go. And so from here, we're gonna just go ahead, take this door and head out to the summer's kitchen, the pool area, your dock, the views, everything you're gonna to wanna to see right here. Talk about amazing summer's kitchens. We have this all black layout, which I'm a huge fan of. Some people are not into it, I, I love it. Nice stonework up here. Again, waterfalls on each side. And how about this? Look at this slide out fridge. Perfect for drinks, perfect for food, perfect for entertaining, really. And just across the massive Histan barbecue grill, huge. And it's got the same black finish going down. It just matches perfectly. A vent above for your outdoor grill. Interesting, love that. And when it's time to actually enjoy the meal that you prepared in this amazing kitchen, look what you're doing it. Are you seeing the view? Oh my gosh. Incredible, there's a skylight above, so I'm getting this natural raise, and then it's just facing the water. And the best part is, is while you're enjoying the meal, you can simply click one button, and you have these screens that come down. And if you're a native Floridian, maybe you're new here, we got mosquitoes, all right? Sue us, don't sue us. But this is our answer to mosquitoes. Screened, automatically comes down, protects you, offers a little SPF protection, and you still get to enjoy the views from the comfort of your outdoor kitchen area. And so before we actually head outside, I wanna show you the whole pool area in a second. I wanna show you the guest house. Sometimes you need a separate place, family comes over or in-laws, this is where you send them, you know? And they have it all, there's no complaints. Right through here, we have their living room. And on the first floor as well, there's even a bathroom. And if you thought that was cool, they even have their own laundry room. Well, it's access to the outdoor laundry room, really, because this is shared with the summer's kitchen. So a full laundry room out here for the house, for the people in the pool who just want to put their wet swimsuits away, easy. And a little quick surprise is this is how you get through the, to the garage. Take a look at this. Into the garage, there's a little treat. This is an amphibious car, meaning that you can drive this thing into the water and it'll turn into a boat and you can drive around the bay. And this puppy will set you back $400,000. It's already been sold, unfortunately, but if you'd like to buy one just like it, I'll put the link below where you can find it. You're welcome. Back inside. I'll take you guys upstairs so you can see the extent of this guest house. This is an entire separate, I should have done a property tour of the guest house, I'll be honest with you. A living room, this is the second living room we've seen so far by the way. View of the water, and then a kitchen that rivals most kitchens of the people watching this channel, I can imagine. I mean this is like, who, is your kitchen better than this, is that what you're telling me? You have these kind of countertops, you have this dual open fridge, fully stocked with Pellegrino, freezer down below, are you, sink, there's an oven, there's a wolf stove, vent above, and we haven't even seen the guest bedrooms. Look at this. Down here, you have guest bedroom number one with the bathroom and a second bedroom, full ensuite. Look at the design of the sink as well. I love how it's like in its own space, but look at the view from this room. Pool views, the same mountain hearing, hurricane impact windows, like I said, this is a separate house. Let's head back down. I want to show you the backyard now. There's so much to see down there, follow me. Color me speechless. Here we have it. The long awaited pool area of this home. View that just never seems to end, it never gets tired. The fountains, places to sit and lounge. And as we make our way a little bit further, look at this. Chairs in the water, butt in the water, knees out of the water, feet in the water, you're welcome. And it all waterfalls down from this rectangular jacuzzi. I don't care where in the world you're from, this is impressive, you can't beat it. And an area that really resonates with me as an individual, I'm sure it does for some of you as well, is over here. So 
So in the center of this home, as soon as you came in, you had the formal living room. This is your formal outdoor living room. I mean, look at this. You come out here, the aunties, the uncles, the cousins, the friends, they're smoking a cigar, drinking a glass of wine. And this is where you do it. And you're all doing it with that view in the distance, with the pool steps away. It doesn't get much better than this. And from here, just down over there, it's gonna lead you to your dock and a few other surprises, but I'm gonna say that because you can access that through the main suite. So from here, follow me back, let's head inside. We still have to finish up the first floor, head to the second floor. This tour just begun. And so from here, we're gonna continue on with the first floor, but we do have to pivot upstairs real quick because it leads you into two guest bedrooms. They're huge. And this guest bedroom has access to use this guest bathroom. Look at the towel work on the floors, the accent lighting in here, another funky mirror. This place, once again, the design is just amazing. But that isn't even the most you know, amazing room. In here, the room's even bigger and you get access to two balconies. So we'll start with this one on my right. You step out and look what you're greeted with. A bogan villa, you know, the view of the water, the pool. I can hear the waterfall. I can see the dock. I mean, wh what did the guests have to do to earn this room? It's gonna be a lot of fighting for rooms, but there are a few beautiful guest rooms. So maybe this isn't even the best one. We'll have to wait and see. But let me show you the front balcony. It's even nicer, I think. Yeah, yeah, 100%. Look at this. Out here, more Bogan Villas. I guess this guy's the thing with Bogan Villas. And here we are. Tons of space, and we are in Saltfish Point. Nice and private. Look, quiet community, no real traffic passing by. And so heading back inside, let's actually make our way back down. We, hit, we still have to finish the first floor, see the main suite, see the other side of the second story. You guys, we just got started. Get your favorite drink, follow me. This place is incredible. Feels much bigger than 9,000 square feet. And what do you know? Another guest bedroom on my left. This one, furnished, so you can get a better visual and look at it. Just the accent lighting on the shelves, the beams again, the same as that we saw in the living room, and of course, these views. This is what it's all about. When you live on the water, you gotta emphasize it as much as possible. And that's what this room does perfectly. And again, for the guest, flawless. I wish everybody cared about their guests like these people did. As we make our way further down, it's gonna take us now down to the other side. And look at this huge open shot. Once again, this is what people are seeing when they walk in. Incredible. You got some people over, it's a fun Friday night. You know, we're chilling, right? Of course. Bar, you need this. Bar stool seating. This is, you're telling me we're not at a Surfside beach club restaurant bar area right now? Fooled me, fooled me. And here we have it. And above there's a skylight. So when you're, you know, how's this look? Good. You'll have it. Okay, I'm put back on the ice for you. And, Besides the storage down below for the bartender, got wine coolers over here, the whole wall of liquors and windows. So if you wanna get some fresh air, pop these guys open. Light fixture, cloud nine, amazing. So let's make our way around this glass wall, if you'd like to call it that, and take a look at the office. This is the executive office. The executive, gotta have one. Walk inside with me, people. Are you, is this a joke? Oh. How did they know? Jason is a cigar guy, big cigar guy. Absolutely incredible places for your people to sit. You guys know the vibes, but what a place to get some work done or smoke a cigar. And so we'll make our way, follow me, follow me. We'll make our way to this side of the second story. Wow, call it a loft. You know, it's a little bit more of a study kind of vibe, but when you walk up, wraparound views, the balcony, what an incredible room. And you know what? I think, well, I don't even know why we're inside right now. What a waste of time. Let's get outside immediately. And from here, you can actually see the brand new metal roof that was installed. Your electric bill, don't even worry about it. It just got knocked down a few million. <laughs> but from right here, it's like the king of the castle. Look at this. 
you're walking around overlooking your private view, you know, the pool area that we took a look at, everything up here, it's beautiful. And this is like the, the best part right here, overlooking it all. Let's head downstairs, let's take a look at the main suite. Follow me. It's time for the main suite. Step down. This is just the entryway into the bedroom, right? So you walk in, and it's like, which door do I choose? Which door do I choose? So we'll start with the first door on my right. This is actually your closet. When you walk in, you've got tons of space. You're gonna have to mind some of the stuff. This home was just recently finished. The reason I wanted to bring you in here is you actually have a washer and dryer. You have no excuse to have laundry sitting anywhere. This is where it's the easiest. And then there's actually a second closet as big as that one was right over here. This one, I'd love to take you inside because it's got a lot of space, it's cleared out. Look at this, absolutely amazing, tons of space. Nobody is fighting who got what closet. You're both happy. And there's a little feature in the closet right here. Open this up. And you have a golf cart garage. So if you're just trying to sneak out and play a little golf at night, I'm sorry if your wife is watching, I just ruined the surprise. Easily, you got the access to that right over there. Right here, I'll let the camera eat first after you. This one stands out. It's just from floor to the wall to the light fixture. The way it's designed is amazing. Look at the cabinetry by the sink, the replica on the other side, and look at how your water closet is hidden. You know, slide this little frosted door, and now you've got privacy to do your thing. And when it comes time to take a shower, you may be thinking like, okay, I see the tub, where's the shower? I'm in the shower. There's a shower head over here, its own jets, its own everything, its own view, and then the same thing on the other side. And in the center, the Kuchimon soaking tub. You got the Kohler deep dish tub, little place to put your soap. What more do you need in the bathroom? I'm selling this place like it's my last sale of life and it's very easy to do so. But from here, it's time to take a look at where you're sleeping every night. Where do you rest your head after working so hard, get this beautiful house, it's time to go to bed. Where's it happening? It's gonna happen right over here. We step in. This is a great place to retire at night. King size bed, the light fixtures again. The whole room, windows looking out into the water, into your pool area, and a place to just sit, hang out, relax, but there's one last thing I'd like to show you. If you follow me over here. We're gonna head out this door. So you walk out. You can come sit. This little seating over here under the coconuts, you know, some sand hammock, you know, beach kind of vibe. And then finally, the dock. This is where your baby is parked, where you go out and have a day of fun with the family. A spot for two wave runners lifted out of the water, no fixed bridges, luxury area, beautiful brand new home. It's on the market, it's waiting for you. What else do you wanna see? So I just wanna say on that note, I love you. I care about you. I care about you more than any other YouTuber cares about their audience. That's a fact. And if you have any questions about this property, about me personally, my email's in the description. Ask away and I'll point you in the right direction. I'll take care of you. I take care of everybody that loves this channel. And again, don't forget to subscribe, like, share this with your favorite uncle who lives in Stuart, Florida. Let's make it happen. Have a good day.